Hello, today I'm going to show you how you can make a simple script using Windows Mobile and QuickTest Professional. Now on my screen I already have QuickTest Professional running and also the device manager. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to select Tools, Remote Device Screen and enable the remote device screen for this Windows Mobile device that I have connected to my PC. That will show the screen on my desktop and you can see what's going on. This is an active screen so any input sent to this screen uh, will be sent directly to the device. Now to create a simple script in QuickTest Professional, you just press Recording. It's important that you select the second option here, Record and Run Only On. Press OK. What I'm going to do now is I'm just going to fill in some information, like my name, the company I work for. And then I'm going to select uh, the second top. Now, as you can see, for each action on the device, a record statement is recorded in uh, QuickTest Professional. And finally, I'm going to check this checkbox. And that concludes this script. So I'll press Stop Recording. Now, if I want, I can change the information uh, in my script. For instance, I can fill in a different name here like this and set the checkbox to false like this now if I run this script it should fill in the new information uh, on the device so it's going to fill in the name company stays the same it's going to make the selection in the top and finally it's going to put, set the checkbox to false Okay. Now if we have a look in the object repository, we can see that for each object we can recognize uh, the attributes of this object. For instance, for the more checkbox, we can see the text, the index, the ID and the class name. Now these properties are configurable. You can just select Tools, Object Configuration and if you select um, the more checkbox, you can see here the identifying properties for this object. You can click Add, Remove, and then you can choose between these properties and decide which should be identifiable for this object. Okay. Now, if you're not sure which object this is in the object repository, you can always click uh, Highlight an application, and that will show it on the remote device screen. And that is everything you need to get started in creating your first test script.